Look at this. Mini bacon sandwich. <laughs> My daughter says you need a shave. That's Dave's line. <laughs> Oh, the power doesn't quite line up. No. Obviously, put it slightly too far apart. You had three pizzas. <laughs> I hope they're like small Chicago town ones, not, you know, 12 inch. So oh, puppies, were you expanding the southern wall? No, and, I, uh, I was seeing what bases were out there. Once this wall's done, I'm going to build a train transport system. Yeah, you're not going to eat three 12-inch Sainsbury's pizzas, Lucas. That's just never going to happen. I was thinking of lighting up this uh, turret, this uh, <laughs> artillery. It might be better doing that when we've got fully defended walls rather than when we're halfway due to construction. Yeah, I'm standing here at the border that we have a nice wall. The base just outside this wall, Tom, needs to go. Okay, yeah, that's what I was looking at. I can get him. Thank you. Have we got any wall being built anywhere? Yep, loads of it. Did you, you put, request did you it? Yeah. Go into your backpack. Just build, and as long as you're on the bot network, it'll build automatically. Just need to have robo ports in your backpack. I have fifteen rounds. That should be enough. Incoming. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> Puppy's down. Don't think they were happy with us, Tom. No, not a bit. Science space pack is finished. Work a robot speed, that sounds good. That's never a bad thing. Well, that was close. <clears throat> one is pepperoni stuffed crust, one is deep pan cheese, and the other is a barbecue pulled pork. And you're going to eat them all in one session.
Hmm. Are we definitely making substations into a provider chest? Yep. They might just take a while to get to you because you're like the other end of the base. That doesn't help either. Yeah, we need um, robot speed. I've seen people play this game and the bots are flying around like they're on caffeine. You're on the last one now. Dude, how can you eat three 12 inch pizzas on your own? Yeah, but Lucas, his stomach is only so big. If you eat a 12 inch pizza and then start on another 12 inch pizza, at some point your stomach just can't take any more. So no amount of putting it in your mouth and chewing is going to fix the problem. Make your way to the south wall, armed and ready to go. Also, when you when you have pizza, like the pizza dough expands in your stomach. So when you drink, <laughs> you're gonna blow up. <laughs> Which way were you thinking of going with the wall down here on the south? Uh, I'm gonna go straight across. And I'm gonna go. To, where am I gonna go? I'm gonna go south to where the cliffs are. Extend the wall uh, south to there and then go east. How far does that to reach? <clears throat> it actually reaches quite far. Like, if you had an artillery train here, it would just literally start destroying all these. Like, it's a, it's quite a big circle. And it'll just continuously shoot anything in range. Speaking of which, I think we should probably have scanners down up here. So if you look at the mini map top right, when you're putting down one of these things, you can see what kind of coverage you've got. So like the, the blue is where is if if I put one down now, that's what it'll cover, and the light blue is where we've currently got scan. Now there's a little base down here. Need to be a bit careful. You used to do two 20 inch pizzas in one sitting. Oh my god.
What else have we got? Power armor. Combat robotics. Combat robotics. Some robot types will follow you and other types of stationary. Portable fusion reactor. Well, color me interested. How do I make the power armor? Wowzers. 60 blue. 40 engines, 30 low density structure. Oh my god. Rip. Bot speed, that's what I need. Because Langevelt, when you fire the rocket, it says to you, do you want to finish or do you want to continue? So basically you can click finish and that ends the game. Or you click continue and carry on enjoying yourself and research all the way through the tech tree. Well, I don't know if we are donut. not. We'll have to find out. Stuff is taking forever to get here. So the problem is I've got this like logistics leg here. I need to have like another logistics section there and another one here. That's a big, big base. Is that a tank? Yep, and I got you a present. Oh, oh you star. Where's mine? Look what's in the tank. I notice it's got stuff. It's got 13 explosive cannon shells. Well, there's a little base down here. Drive by shooting, I like it. Oh, they can tank some armor pierce and they can. Flippin' eh? Hey. Oh, this is so much fun. You just switch to explosive shells and stuff just dies rapidly. Look at this one last guy. I might just kite this guy away somewhere. Aw. I was having fun with him. <laughs> I was going to lead him all the way back to the laser turrets. I've only got five shells left. I'm making more, so I shall put some more in your tank. Wow, I have no repair. Dark times. You can run over the biter spawner. Is that your mobility scooter? What, with a gun turret on it? Echolos, have a good night. You may have a handheld rocket launcher in the back of your tank as well. A handheld rocket launcher. Am I not going to need some fuel for that, though? Like, no, it just like... takes the cannon shells that we use for the town. Uh...
They can repair your tank, I think. That's a lot of biters. I don't think I should light up my uh, artillery from here. No, that's what I'm saying. If they all run down here, we're going to get toasted. This wall is not finished. The problem is logistics is taking a while to get here because there's not enough um, robo ports on route. Right, what was we gonna do? Work a robot I speed. I have walls if we're trying to put those down. Oh, never mind. I only have eighty. <laughs> Yeah, I have none. Look at these little critters running after me. <laughs> Look how many APs they take, though. That's crazy. I've got some serious defense. A few here, eh, little survivors. Oh boy, that's a big nest. A lot of spitters there, Tom. Time for me to leave. Recommend you jump. Do not jump out of your tank. I was wondering what you was doing <laughs> then. <laughs> Is this safe yet? <laughs> Right, robot speed, what else do we need? Follow a robo count. Could get lab research speed. Energy weapon damage would be very good. Insert the capacity bonus efficiency module, physical projectile damage, stronger explosives. You should get the atomic bomb. <laughs> Those bases. I, I'm gonna have to jump off. I gotta go and mourn. Alrighty. All right. Thanks for being here. No problem. I shall speak to you later. Alrighty. Yeah, there's some big nests down there, Motley. I am being extremely careful. I'm building a bit of wall, putting in lasers. Well, putting in lasers, there's building a wall, there, clearing, Motley. building. Pizza's all gone. 
That's unreal. Yeah, you see the bots here, how slow they're making it up here? That's the problem. Oof, look at that. Deforestation. Imagine if you could take trees down that quick. No firefighters, some of them did. Oh boy. Oh boy, there's like a million bot insects. Tom, are you shooting them? Because I'm nowhere near my tank. <laughs> I just saw the radar. Yes. Yeah, I keep bringing them over here. I'm like running, I was away from my tank just building stuff and then just saw like a swarm of red dots running at me. Like that. Yeah, you will turn around and run away. Some tough cookies, these guys. Spetters are a nightmare. They can really catch you out. Now, ah, come over here. I've got a little gift for you. Come on. Oh. Oh, you died to a laser. How unfortunate. I have one shell left. As if.
I need to build some more um, explosive shells. I thought I could stop quicker. You want to buy a factory, but you're scared you'll get addicted. You probably will. <laughs> I don't know, Nukin's a bit crude, isn't it? Creates a lot of um, toxic pollution. Oh no, I just got rid of that thing. Oh. Deconstructed the wrong thing. Fill that bar, and then we'll have that bar. I'm gonna try and get the rest of the wall over here. Uh, flights forever. Thank you for subbing. Welcome to the house flights. You know, like one stupid old tree and you can't put a blueprint down. Like, really? See how long that takes to get over here. Rep Tom Sunday, twenty nineteen. I guess you bit off more than you can chew. I'm guessing so, yes. <laughs> Shift click the blueprint. Does that allow you to put it down anyway? Not getting much in the way of bots over here. I think what it is, they're trying to go across this. That's what they're trying to do. Probably need to build down on the... Um, they're trying to go into a straight line, I think, rather than path around the robo base. It's a nice base. way to clear out your inventory, though. <laughs> well, that's true. Yeah, look, they're trying to cross this vast kind of chasm. That's why it's taken a while to get here. Nuclear bomb only creates pollution when it explodes. Pollution that it creates dissipates fast after the explosion. I just kind of assumed that it would just pollute an area for a long time. Okay, that's the south part of the wall uh, built. That's quick.
just be aware that there's nests inside your wall. Yeah, that's why I haven't uh, taken down the bottom. Obviously, we're going to need to clear them out. Drop some scanners down there as well. Follow a robot count. Character logistic trash slots. Personal robot too. Allows construction robots to work in the inventory. Don't they already do that? Sounds like it can't be bad. Scanners are up. First one is 10 bots, level 2 is 25. Ah. So, what do you need to do? Make some of these explosive cannon shields, steel plate, plastic bar, and explosives. Should be really manufacturing those things. I need to focus on the wall. Didn't realize you had Twitch. <laughs> Morris, I've mentioned Twitch a lot in my videos. Welcome, anyway. You can hear a buzzing noise through your headphones. Just wonder if the stream computer or anyone else. I can't hear a buzzing. If I, I hear what you hear, if I could hear a buzzing, I would know. Oh my god. Stop! Why is all this flashing away? Wait, I'm sure we make gun turrets. I definitely made gun turrets somewhere. Grenades. Maybe we don't make gun turrets? Hmm. Is it in the right chest? That's a good question. Right, I just need to nip for a bio break. Go for a bio, be right back.
Tom, I'm having a real blonde moment. How do I get into the tank? Hit the enter key. Uh, that's the one. Oh, I'm back. Chat hype. Well, this didn't die. <laughs> I'm back. WB. So I've now got logistic network bar. That should help. I might just not bother with these. Do you seem to be flying around a little bit quicker? You connect the log network north south one more. Oh, logistic network. Got you. Hang on. Ugh. It's cold and raining outside. Physical projectile damage. Let's turn that. Interesting. Need to connect through here, don't we? It takes ages to stop in the tank. It's crazy. Do it. You need some carbon ceramics on that. <laughs> Explosive cannon shell. Let's get that made. Yeah, we need to automate explosive shells and things like this. nests look at the size of these nests there that's nasty okay that should really start to help you're flying to london heathrow today from madrid during the return
should do it. I've had a nice day. Not bad. Had a bathroom go around this afternoon. Going to get our bathroom done. Which should have been done last October. But ended up not being. Because the guy who did our kitchen, one of the guys that worked for him does bathrooms and he was going to do the bathroom. And uh, he took ill and stuff. <clears throat> So I postponed it to December, and then he got somebody else, so we said, okay, well, well he, he got some other job in, so we said, all right, we'll postpone it to, like, March. So I booked him in for March, and then when I turned around to him a few weeks ago and said, so you're doing it? He said, oh, no, I'm doing somebody else now. It's like, what? <laughs> so I've slacked him off. Got somebody else in. Ryan Clark, love your streams. Glad to see you playing Factorio again. Thank you for 25. Honestly, utter scumbag. When they finished the kitchen, Mrs. Squirrel gave, like, him and the other guy that did it, like, a big bag of um, stuff, like, treats for him and his missus and stuff. And then he just goes and uh, messes us about completely. So thanks for that. Get run over. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not that bothered. Mrs. Squirrel was really annoyed. Like, she was not happy at all. She was wanting to text him and tell him what she thought of him, and I was like, there's no point. Just let it go. Just let it go. Nothing you say to him is going to make him come back, and we don't want him to come back anyway, so what's the point? But yeah, she wasn't happy. No, she was, uh, honestly, she was that, like, it was yesterday. No, the day before yesterday. All afternoon, every time I saw her, she was like, Arr. and then the next day, she was like, Arr. I said, just let it go. Rip. That's me dead. <laughs> okay, I may need some help getting my body back. And my tank's been really? completely destroyed. Yeah, they basically smothered my tank and I couldn't move. Then they trashed the tank, I got out, then they trashed me. So, um, Tom, have you got a tank? <laughs> I do. I was looking at the map to see where you were. Well, I've lost my um, stuff right in the middle of a big biter's nest, so... I need help. You coming up to the top left, or, or were you somewhere else? It's, um, if you look where the copper smelting array is on the east, it's the nest right next to that, I think. Yeah, I was running some power lines out there to, uh, to do the turret creep with the lasers. 
And right as I was doing something, you called me. <laughs> I panicked and pushed the space bar and shot half our, <laughs> half my <laughs> lasers. <laughs> oh, I could so say something, Lynn. Well, these furnaces are not even at half capacity. Look at this. We need to get making more stuff. Man, I'm going to lost a load of stuff now. Can't believe I lost a tank. And I just built 25 explosive shells for it, so I've lost that as well. What a scumbag. Is there, an, is there an entrance I can drive in down there? Um, it's just a big... I mean, I shot a few, but there's, don't let them uh, surround you because they will just grab hold of your tank and you can't move. They're a real pain. Come on, come this way. We've got a little gift for you. There it is, pew pew. Like I literally can't do anything at this point. I can't I can't run over that. You should use beacons and prod three modules. What does that do? And the bots come over and start filling my backpack with stuff. Yay! I know, Captain Flint. I'll have to put a box down just to put stuff in it. In fact, what I'll do is I'll make a an iron chest now. <laughs> Beacons make assemblers produce faster. And productivity modules make them produce more. Don't have beacon yet. 